Hello and welcome to day 13 of Darkwood. Um, I'm actually a little confused because it's been a while. So let me get my bearings. I believe... So I'm really confused because I have actually played through about a day and a half's worth of stuff. And then my computer crashed and I found out that A, OBS doesn't save and B, that Steam doesn't do save game versions. Because, you know, Darkwood is one of those games that, that like Dark Souls and, you know has that rolling save thing to make sure that you can't go back on your decisions. Um, but I'm pretty sure day 13 is actually the right day. Maybe it's off by one day, so I lost less progress than I looked at. I don't know exactly how that happened, um, but I'm kind of glad for it, because it does mean that I get to, uh, I guess, not really lose the footage and the, uh, yeah, the footage mostly. Um, yeah, I'm a little confused. I. In case that happens in the future, I went ahead and like shoved my uh, my save file for Darkwood into like Simlink and drop it into Dropbox, so that if that does happen in the future, I'll be able to push it back if I need to. Zero reputation. 8 a.m. I don't remember if I died on the night of day 12. I guess there might be a video. I'm not sure. Because again, confused as hell. Uh, no, I think this is definitely old. Because I got stuff in here that I sold the wolf. Alright, cool. We're, we're fine, I guess. I don't think I need anything from the tree. The tree. The three. I don't want my shovel edge. How rude. Um, no, I'm sad that I apparently died, but it's been a long time, I'm sorry. I haven't been playing because I've been busy, and because when, you know, when I lost my save file to a crash in all the footage, I felt a little bit like flipping tables, so I was like, nope, nope, this can wait. But to my surprise, everything seems fine, so I guess that'll teach me in the future, I guess I should just actually check on things. Man, his hideout's super close. I got really lucky. Hey, Wolfie. Yes, meat. Yes, indeed, meat. Uh, don't need that anymore. I don't need that anymore. You can have them. Um, wire's tempting. I'm gonna leave my reputation with you, because I have a feeling I might want something from you at some point. So, away I go. I apologize if you were waiting to uh, to hear some banter or something from the previous episode resume because I frankly have no idea. It has been that long for me, about a week, pretty hectic week actually. So, all right, I'm gonna go stick the shovel edge away. Well, I don't actually know what to do with the shovel edge. I'm gonna drop it just because. I don't want it. <laughs> Wolf doesn't want it. Three doesn't want, don't want it. Eh. Ah, we do need to go see the chicken lady, though. Probably. Maybe. I don't know. I'm still feeling like I, day 12 was when I went down there. Um, oh, I also wanted to grab the chain. That's why I was there. So yeah, that doorway to the village, by the way, is indeed the right thing to be doing. I do at least remember that I was like, I don't know if this is right. It looks a little spooky. Let's not know. Uh, I'll just lift that one off. This this corpse is a good waypoint, actually, because he's about good ways in. Hey, stupid mushrooms. Oh, a crate, which I can't open. I don't have lockpick. Yes. Pure tracks. The bug thing. Burial site? No? Yeah, I don't know. I'm running into a tree. <sighs> hey, Moose. Stay over there. Don't come here. I have an axe this time. I don't think it would be too much trouble. But I don't want to find out. Are those mushrooms? No, well, they're not enough mushroom, apparently. Oh yeah, the larva sack! Yes, I want to leave this for later. 
um, because I want to verify the thing about of an efficiency in that item, because I have a feeling, like, the amount of essence that thing gives is insane. So I have a feeling that it might be a fixed amount, so that you always get the same no matter what. Which is a little bit fair, because, you know, rare item exception. But, uh, it might not, which means that, A, I will be rewarded for waiting until, until the, uh, Cool. It's a little Lovecraftian. It's a little weird Cthulhu monster thing. Cthulhu Virgin Mary. That's exciting. Um. Oh yeah. Okay, that happened the last time too. Alarming though it may be. I'm still thinking about the lost footage. Time, really, because I guess I didn't lose footage. I'm getting it again this time. Hey you! Nobody in particular. Okay. I'm glad to see a field that's not infested with choppers, though. That makes me happy. There's a house. So I did explore this place previously. There's a house over here. Ooh, mushrooms! I missed that. Yes! They'll rot, probably, before I can get... Uh, one thing to notice is that time does stop here, which is nice, but also weird, because, I don't know, it means, like, it means that these videos will probably be very long, because I won't be gated by the usual, the usual amounts. Locked from the other side. Oh, I see, it's got a little thing. Two puns. I like how the entire wardrobe is like, yeah, whatever, but it's like, oh, man, there's a couple of planks behind that one. We'll never figure that one out. Need keys. Okay. That looks good. Little hole there. So there is something going on in this story that suggests. Uh, well, I guess we'll see. Suggests something about underground and trees, and I wonder if it has some connection to some like Polish myths or something that I'm not totally familiar with. But it's an interesting idea. Just the. The, like, there's a connection implied between choppers and trees and the, the insectoid stuff. There's definitely something going on there, but I don't know what it is, really. I really hope it goes somewhere interesting, though. Hey, you. So these guys are all friendly in here. I mean, are they? I hadn't noticed. Too busy trying not to get eaten. Talk? Rub me. Yes. Okay. Dead cow. Pigs. Pigs and chickens. Um, and this is all gated off. You can kind of see over the trees, but I guess this is to reinforce the whole, like, there's a whole finite wall of trees. Like, something has circled us in here. Which is cool, because it's... What? Meat. Yeah? Why? Who's on tech? I hope they're not talking about the rotting meat. Hey, chicken. Do they take an interest in you, or... Oh. That would be cute. The chickens... You know, if you stand around long enough, they'll just come up to you and... cock for a little bit. Some of them, you know, personalities or something. Probably completely unnecessary for this game, if I think about it, really. But, yeah, neat. Alright. Chest. With secret. Um, wait, are there drawings on the floor? What are they? Can't really parse them. Note. Oh, happy, happy day. Today I get to see her again. I hope she likes what I have prepared. She doesn't have an appetite lately, but we have our ways around that now, don't we? That's, that should be now, don't we? Not now, do we? I've dug up something very special for her today. My queen! Only I can be close to her. No one else! No one! I won't let anybody near you again. I can't tell if that's 4-7 or 6-7, but it's something 7. Hey. Okay, so... I'm 
gonna give these a couple of tries. So very clearly my progress did get reset, and I don't know how. I'm guessing that the same reason I lost the footage, and it's not even... It's partly my fault for... Um, I was using MP4 before, which is not a stream, fully streaming codec, so I could have gotten a corrupted MP4. I'm not really gonna spend too much time trying on that. There's a... Uh, but yeah, that note would have been picked up if it had saved my progress. So, this is the first time we're here, and everything's hunky-dory, which is great. I don't know how that happened. I'm guessing that for whatever reason, the same reason that my file didn't... Hello. Why? Really? Uh, yeah. Well, I don't know. I tried to kill it a couple times. That's unfortunate. Who's on tech? Hmm, I hear a chomper somewhere. So these are on battle doors that need keys. Presuming on tech is a chomper. And he's in the basement. Great! Sure, I'll get that key one day, maybe. I'm not actually sure. Three generators, damn. What does he keep in that basement, other than the chomper? I wonder if he uses that to secure the chomper, maybe? Who? Why? I don't think anybody knows what the hell's going on. Seems to be doing what he can. Yeah, you all do that. Okay, burnt doctor's bag. So this is the same thing we saw in the beginning, but now burnt. Ooh, I like a little shadow effect. Following it around. I'm now carrying that around. Yeah. Not the friendliest of villagers, but at least they're not hostile. Sturdy chain. So, okay, I can use the chain to get into the well. And that was where it crashed for me, by the way. I had gone into the well, and then boom, and I was very upset. Very upset, indeed. Hey, house. Don't mind me. I belong here. Mm-hmm. Yes. That's so... What did I say before? Because... For doctor's instructions, wash wounds with alcohol three times a day. Diet should consist only of potatoes, one tablespoon beet juice twice a day. I don't think that does anything. I wonder if that's also just like some kind of um, like anesthetic or drug, right? D just something to keep you, keep them high and off their uh, miseries. The trees hum so beautifully. So the, what's cool about that is that it draws a connection with the grave dream which wasn't there before. I like this village area. Sorry, I'm not reacting to it as much as I probably should be because you think it's my first time, but it's not for me actually my first time. Weapon parts, I missed this the first time. That's great. But yes, this village is weird. There's a lot of stuff there. Bath full of pig's forage, great. What could go wrong with that? Is that a thing people do? Pig forage in the tub? I guess they're eating the pigs, so I was dying. But yeah, I really like that connection with the with the, the grave dream, because that puts a, you know the, the trees hum so beautifully. That's what becoming a chopper is like, I guess. Does he now? Yeah. What happens to the others? Run off into the woods and never come back, huh? Great. And then I kill them, because they come into my house at night. So what prevents me from just continuing the rest of my life in here? This place seems nice. I think I could make do. I don't really need bottles. They're worthless to me. I don't make traps. I don't think you can make the trap anymore, can you? You used to be able to turn them into broken grass. Broken grass. Broken glass and toss that on the floor to, like, hurt stuff. But I don't think you can do that anymore. I don't see the crafting item. Uh, why does the rest of the world go away? 
What's he been etching on the floor? So that's a lot of matchsticks. I don't really know what you're trying to tell me with a bunch of matchsticks and a. I guess I have enough of these. I'll come back. I'll be back at some point. The other thing I don't quite know about this game is that they've had. Like, they have a church and they have a cross here, which is clearly, like, Christian religious imagery. And what I'm unsure about is whether this is supposed to be, uh... Like, is it just some kind of... Is it an actual, like, pseudo-Christian church that has sort of adopted the... Because we had the church dream already. Um, so is it, you know, a kind of Christian church that's sort of gone wayward and has adopted, um worship of these tree things for some reason because um, there's also like the, the allusions to witchcraft and stuff or is it like is this just you know that 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 cult is the religion and it's just some kind of um they use the same symbols just to get across that it's can you now that's great Oh, I can walk over your top half. That's great. I could murder you. But I won't. I'll wait until I have to. That's just wall. Yeah, I remember being confused by that before. I'm trying to, like, go around it. But yeah, I don't know. If it's just supposed to be generic. Like, is the fact that it's a Christian church important? Is it supposed to be a distorted Christian thing? You know? Or is it just, uh, religion? There it is. Don't worry about me. I'm nobody. There's the well. I'm gonna keep exploring for now. Hey, place. I see an oven. This oven is mysteriously lacking all of the stuff that I recognize on an oven. I move these chair these around for a long time before, so I'm not going to suffer you through that. There's nothing under them, <laughs> if you're wondering. At least I didn't find anything, so I'm not going to bother again this time. Hey, you! How are you doing? You don't react to me like the others, which I enjoy. Ah, yes, the holes. See this one? See that? Just a couple of... Uh-huh. Bottom. Uh huh. A wide tunnel. Handprints can be seen in the ground. I wonder where it leads. Oh, I can enter it. I missed that before. Someone is inside this hole. I can barely make out a silhouette. It looks like a grown man with very long hair. He's all covered in black mud. So I think that's suggesting that this is kind of how people turn into chompers. They eventually, like, they get consumed by some urge to, like, dig, and they get covered in mud. So they start digging holes and wanting to be in the dark, and then they feel the allure of the trees and run off or something. Maybe they're not really trees, though. I feel like this is a bad idea. Let's go finish exploring this place first, because we're not really on a time limit. Yeah? Sorry. What? Wait, so he wasn't talking to me? What are you talking about? Who are you talking about seeing through the trees? I like how there is this little alcove though that's like squeezed through here. Does he see something over here? It reminds me of what the doctor said before though, but I don't know if this is the doctor or not. I understand why he's drinking, though, because his house has been turned into mush. How does the stacking work with the aging system? Oh, apparently it takes the oldest one. Of course it does. Why would I expect mercy from this game at any point? It's a little bit cruel about the stacking, though. Dead rats and potatoes. The potatoes give stamina. I ate a few. That last play session. I don't think I need more of these, but I could be wrong. I could be misremembering. I don't think the dead rats are actually worth anything. I don't know why someone put a dead rat in a wardrobe, actually. That's a little weird. Oh, there is a thing over there. Let's go.
go over there. And here, there's so many places to go. Have I been here already? Doesn't look like I have. Ah. All right, what's this place? All right, it's the place to the north of the hole. The well. I'm getting a better idea of the layout of this place than I did last time. Needs key, huh? What about this one? Needs lockpick. And that is that guy's place, the guy who has a chomper in his basement. This place just looks grim. It's the grimmest of buildings. Alright, let's break in. There we go! Also, who leaves a bathtub in the front entrance? Or maybe it's locked because it's no longer a front entrance. I think I spent some time moving all this crap too, and there's nothing under it. Neither is there anything under that bed. I'll take this. I will. Uh, don't need. I need this. Well, that's no longer true because I can use that stuff for. I have a lot of crap. I'll take all of it. I'm fine with this. I'll be back here, I'm sure, at some point. I'll see that bag and no one in particular. What are you doing? Sigh. Nothing in the oven. Bone and jars filled with minced meat, which I can use. But don't tell anyone. Needs key to get back here. Hmm. Kinda wanna go back there. He's got meat. Minced meat that he doesn't want me to tell anyone about. Which I think means it's human meat. Um, and if we look over here, he's got these like huge oven things, which is which are just creepy. I do think we can lockpick that one, which is why I was interested in the uh, the wire earlier. Oh, does this work? Please don't get me stuck. Okay, cool. Okay, so we're near to that. Yeah, there's all the smoke too. Do you cook people? That's not cool. You shouldn't cook people. You should at least ask them first. Great. Great. She just stares at the ground. Yeah? Alright. Which swine? Kill the swine. Like the swine in this place? Or do you mean the sow? Or do you mean the people here and you are using swine as a derogatory term? Chickens? What's this over here? I don't really know. Let's find out. Wood. It is wood. That was less exciting than I had hoped it would be. Oh, more mushrooms. Let's hope they don't all expire before I can do something useful with them. How are they looking? Is that my time limit here? The mushrooms that I collect? They're what actually makes me have to go away. Oh yeah! Wooden floor is tricky with chicken feces and feathers. This is the chicken lady house. Man, this is in a different place than it used to be. I do want your bread. I have bread somewhere? Oh, okay, there it is. Hey, the chicken lady! Yuli looks at me with suspicion. She holds her chickens close to her. I hope you haven't come for my dearies, you bastard! She puts them over her kitchen, one of the chickens close to her ear, while maintaining eye contact with you. After a while, she eases up. That one looks like it's just loving whatever it is she's doing. So happy. I've seen a lot. I survived the wars, but the things here, God help me. 
this is no place for chickens, young man. I don't know that it's particularly the place for anything. Where did you get this? The chicken lady is upset. The chickens are silent. Tension is in the air. Oh lord, this is Yannick's chick. A gift from me, my brother. A few days ago he got angry. I told him, stay. You're not the educated one. You don't know any better. But he up and went to find the doctor. Here, take this. He went to see him, and he never came back. The old lady pushes a crumpled photo into my hands. Chicken lady's brother. Photo of the doctor. Okay, so this thing's been a long time coming. She is shaking. The chicken on her shoulders can only barely stand in balance. That's funny. You're all I have left, my little sisters. Alright, well. Creepy chicken stuff, as always. Thank the heavens for our blessed sow. The poor thing is a little sickly lately, but she's got more heart than all of us. It's only thanks to her that we have something to eat these days. Cool. Poor Hannah lost her mind. That man made her baby so ugly even the dogs turned their eyes away. Poor thing. The man was burned together with the house, and the creature was taken away from them somewhere. The people were afraid. The lady smiles gently, revealing three yellow teeth. This was a long time ago, but you still remember, little chick. Probably one of the chickens. So that's cool. That's a new story thread. That apparently... That man made her baby so ugly. Makes it sound like presumably her husband. Um, burned together with the house. The creature was taken away from them somewhere. He was killed. So it was because he was like part chomper and their child was some other abomination. Nothing new. Alright. Mother Mary, it's that creature again! The woman's face turns red and she begins to scream, Get the hell off my lawn, you bastard! And enter the musician. Maybe alcohol will be less threatening. I'm sorry. I don't know, I get the feeling whatever it is you're doing has been happening for a while. I thought you were the chicken lady. I saw you inside. Do you not afraid of her? You are so brave. I don't know how old he looks here, the perspective is all weird. Did you also see the pretty lady inside? She's the most beautiful lady in the whole world. But the chicken lady has locked her away in her room and doesn't let anyone inside. Not even me, although she knows I caught the pretty lady's wreath in the river. The law says I am to be her husband now, but the hag will not even let me take her for a walk. She just sits in her room. I dare not even think what she must be going through. It's an interesting marriage custom, I suppose. I tried to free her, but the chicken lady always catches me. I also looked for my spare key in Mr. Yan's place, but now that he has disappeared, I have no way of getting inside his house. Which, where's Mr. Yan's place? Nod, I suppose? Am I not boring you? You are so kind and patient, listening to me complain. Everyone else is fed up with me, even my parents. Maybe... I would not dare to abuse your generosity. I can hear nervous grunting at the tractor. Maybe you would help me? Sure, why not? You're known for a strange boy. I won't be able to get the key into the pretty lady's room. Mr. Yan should have it. I saw him around the well some time ago. Maybe you can find him there? I must hide from the chicken lady. Normally you could find me in my parents' house, but they're angry with me. Please find me inside the silo, in the southeastern part of the fur east silent forest, when you find the key. I will be in your debt. Me and the pretty lady. So one thing the first time I met him was, it, I wasn't clear if he was still the same boy, because the other one clearly had, um, I don't know what it is, the, the speech impediment thing. Um, is it Tourette's? I don't remember. Um, but you know, the, the like, autism slash speech impediment thing that makes you stammer. And uh, he no longer has that, which is interesting. Uh, but he is, you can't tell from here, but we'll meet him back at the silo, which by the way, I guess we'll, when I exit out I'll show you. This is our doctor, yes? He is just as brave and good as you are. He helped me. He is helping all of us. He gave me this beautiful mask so I could be healed of my afflictions. Maybe you could have one too. Oh, that's a neat. Wait, I hadn't picked up on this before. Maybe you could have one too. So that kind of, is that suggesting that we're... Because we've looked in the mirror, probably. I mean, in the, we've looked in past series. And this guy, the guy we're playing as, does not look like he's in the healthiest of states. Um, so what if this is suggesting that he can tell that you look 
the same way that he does under the mask. But although we can't tell right now, he looks the same, like the same little boy from before. And if you realize, he says he's at the silo. I can't do that now. Oh, I can't map in here, damn it. If you look at the silence icon on the map, it's that it's his mask. So that all actually makes sense. That it's, you know, musician place, musician face. Great, makes sense. Um, I don't know how I feel about him no pushing the chicken around. Him no longer uh, having the speech impediment. I thought it did an interesting, like... I don't know, it had an interesting dimension to his character, but maybe it's a little overdone by now, the whole, you know... Kid with speech impediment trope. I just thought it was an interesting difference to show that there's someone who's not quite as able as everyone else. But now he's just a kid and is at best. Scorch remains of wooden construction. Cool. Oh, I missed that one. Oh, yes, wire! Oh man, I want wire so bad. What do I drop for it? Pills, because I have bread. Definitely pills. Great. Please create. Please give me different loot. I wonder if these are random every time. Damn it! No, I guess they're randomly generated once. I'll go ahead and pull you out. Exactly one shotgun shell. It's not exactly a great reward, but you know. So it is. It's better than nothing. I can come back for all the eggs, which at least previously gave uh, stamina. Large mushrooms. Are these different? I guess it's just more of them. Does it just take longer? What's the difference here? I think it just takes longer. There's also a chest outside. Is there any useful in here? Yes, gasoline. Is there anything I want to drop for gasoline? Yes, because I'll be coming back and I do not require potatoes immediately. Uh... Well, those are the wrong pills. I confused them momentarily for the, the health pills. Which would be more interesting to have. Oh. Needs key. So I guess this is the pretty lady he's talking about, which we've I've seen in the past. She's not doing great. Um, but I guess we need to find the key if we're gonna complete that quest. What do I do with this? I do want the tape. The tape is useful. The tape is pretty good. So is rope. And nails and stuff. Eh, eh. Drop that. We'll be back. It'll be okay. Eh. I want to leave the doors open. So I know I've been here. Because I've made it into a mess. That's how I know. So I have a lot of crap now. I'll leave that open. There's no point in closing that. Uh, so that's the chicken lady house. I really wish this place had a map. It's big enough. It's hard enough to orient myself. But I guess part of the reason it doesn't is because if they make a map, then they have to do the, the POI system. Ah, uh, I don't have that code. Have I been in here before? I think I have. What needs to be done? Uh-huh. I don't either. What are you talking about? Trip. Wash wounds with alcohol three times a day. So people get wounds with alcohol. I hadn't, for some reason, I didn't get that from the previous night. If infection spreads, rub wounds with aloe and arnica ointment. Burn herbs in oven. Love edge, camomite, nettle. One tablespoon beet juice twice a day. She's coming down with that. What a stench. Indeed. Yeah. I think she misinterpreted the... Di I like this new effect, too. You see how there's a little bit of, like, smoke following me? That's because there's smoke in here. So arms and legs are tied together with a chain. I can take the chain. But I wonder if he... Did freeze him up? I didn't take the chain before because I have that chain back back home. Oh, he's burned. I think you were you were supposed to burn the herbs. Not him. Ah. 
Maybe I'll drop the gasoline, because that's appropriate. I'll go and make the well chain, and then we'll run back so we can cash out my, uh, my mushrooms that are rapidly aging. And I think that's actually about it. Let's go back out leave this area. I really like this new village area. I mean, I generally like that there's new areas, period. As someone who's been playing since Alpha 1, the change of pace is pretty exciting. Have been here? Yes, that's the chicken baby place. Uh, yeah, that's... I don't think I can go there. Alright, let's follow the road. It will be useful. I wonder if this place is also randomly generated? I guess I'll have to look up a few of other people's videos and see if the layout is the same. But yeah, I really do enjoy that there's something something new for me. Just because it has been a little bit difficult. Maybe I should try the you run where you look with tank controls at some point. Because I'm kind of wishing I had it. I just think it'll be terrible in combat because I'll like hit left and it won't take me the direction I think it should. Alright. Hey you. You gotta do your territorial dance or whatever. Oh right, I, do I still have the... I should have some uh, skill? I don't know. The anti-skill to the effect that I, uh, I don't um, shoot. I, I re regain stamina less effectively if I let it run out. So I have to make sure that I don't let it run out. Otherwise, there's a small penalty. It's nothing dreadful, though. So yeah, see? his That's his mask. And we could go see him, but you know, I'm not going to bother right now, because I've seen him plenty in previous builds. So I'm sure we'll see more of him anyway. I taken all this crap already. Thinking about the map real quick. Uh oh. Oh, there you are. These guys are no longer scary when you have the axe. Partly because of that. It's just like, yep, goodbye. I'll be back for you. I'm pretty sure I just have to go up a little bit. Yeah. Alright. Will I make it? Probably. But, you know, there's a chance that I don't. Yes! Essence extracted. Now I'm gonna run back. Well, I have my chain already. Hold on. Run back. Pick up the meat. Uh... Mm, where is it? There it is. Do you have anything? Yes. Alcohol, which is also useful. Um, I think we can go ahead and consume a bread so that I can run back better. Maybe a pill, just because those are less valuable to me. I was interested in those. Right, I want to cook. Why am I looking at Well, because I do also want to... Yes, good amount of essence. Um, yeah, the gas I don't want to keep carrying around. Uh, I'll stash one of those later. I need this for now. Do need those. Stash that later. I do not need nearly that many matches at any given moment. Don't need this right now. I can make a lockpick, which is exciting. I like that they, they do unify these two. That's cool. I want to make more lockpicks because I know that I will need more weapon parts. Sure. No, don't swap them. Uh, do we have any spare? I don't know. Oh yeah, we pressed up a toolbox somewhere, didn't we? Damn it, I forgot where. Ah, oh, crap. Mm, why didn't I remember that one? Why didn't I pick it up? <laughs> Arg. Anyway, we can deposit the health items now, and I think we should have more than enough time to make it back before nightfall, and also so we don't die on the way back. Nah, yeah, two batteries is good. Two batteries is fine. Oh. Uh, no, wait, where did I... Oh, no, this is the right place. Never mind. Ooh, this bodes well. I'm getting confused already. 
Um, right, and the alcohol. Alcohol's crafting too, though. Nah, whatever. I don't really think there's much to craft. I'll come and grab it when I need it. Um, is that one of you? Yeah, okay. I forgot to offload the wood, because I don't need that much wood either. Um, I'll take three. Well, 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 yeah, it's getting full and hard to manage. Alright. This lasts a good long while, too. My lungs are more efficient. Could also use the, the running skill that I have, but eh. I have a lot of running items. I'm about to pick up even more once we go to Chicken Lady House. Should I be following the road? I don't really remember. I think it's faster if I don't, but I'm not sure by how much. There's Protrex, which is... yeah, well, we just head south. Should be good. To make that well, and also clamor into the hole. I'm curious about the hole. I'm gonna do that first because I haven't seen it before myself. And I have been in the well, and it crashed. So hopefully, uh, it doesn't crash again. Oh, like I hope that was a uh, not an actual problem with the game. Alrighty. We're back. In a time stop. Cool. Plenty of time to make it back. We'll be okay. Is this still aging? Okay, cool. Because that would be an interesting bug if it's uh, during time stops your status effects don't update. I'd welcome it though. I'd be down for that. I want to go look for that. The, uh. I wish I had that coat, but I couldn't kill the sow, because the game's bugged. I'm sure it would be some cool items. Alrighty. That was creepy. Just seeing it move, I was like, Did somebody turned into a chomper? Should I be getting prepared here? I didn't think there would be violence out in this just out in the open, but you know. I can handle it if that's to be the case. I really don't remember where it was. Or why I passed it up. Was it in here? Yeah, sure. So we have something to drop, mostly. There's just so many immutable items in here that makes me think that probably, but on the other hand, I think we explored this pretty thoroughly. You're not doing well. That's not a note. I wish it was. I don't know how I feel about the beds no longer being storage items. I guess they were a little obnoxious just because they're not. They had like one slot or something. It wasn't great. So they weren't useful to you as a player, and you couldn't put much loot in them. Is it in here? I don't think there's any lootable items in here other than the. Well, maybe it's that wardrobe. No. Nope, it's not that wardrobe. Turns out, why is my frame rate dipping? Whoa. Oh. I think the backup job found something to do. No, not now. You're supposed to back off. Ugh. Those are mushrooms. Man, the frame rate is just tanking. 
I hope that's not the sign that it's about to crash. Hey you. Still not responsive. Great. Where was it? Was it in here? This guy's place? Was it the chicken lady? Was it the chicken lady? Ah, let's check out this guy's place one more time. I dropped something here, so presumably. Scrap that one. Great. I don't think I want any of these things. Give me one second. I gotta find out what this is. What's going on here? Interrupts. Is it you? Or is it you? Hmm. Don't trust this. I don't know what it is. Alright, well, we're gonna have to live with it until it goes away, I guess. Sorry about that. Primary looks. No. No. It's still terrible. I can pick this lock though now, which is what I want to do. And we'll see why I want two locks. But okay, that's a dead person. Hello, coal. It's a lot of coal. That's a lot of coal. What is this thing? It's an oven. A brick oven used to break bread. I didn't know that they required such gigantic ovens to break bread. In fact, well, I don't know. I don't know much about the history of ovens, frankly. Maybe this was what you had to use before, you know, modern ovens. Whoa. This would be a great place to drop some mushrooms that you can stop over and screw yourself over. Yeah, I get the feeling there's more um, bad secrets back here. But yeah, I need another lockpick. Because I guess I could murder the guy. He probably has the key. Those just look like human bones. Keep it closed, because that door is not supposed to be open. Alrighty. Um, I do want to make sure that I find items I'm looking for. Where is the chicken lady's house? Is it up here? Or over here? It's over here. I do remember there was at least a lot of loot to grab, so we'll grab some of it before heading down. <laughs> I love that she says that line. It's a good... There it is. Yeah, okay. It is the chicken lady house that I was thinking of. And... I don't really need that because Piotrek's quest is done. I'll take it out anyway, just so it's here and visible. I do want that plank. Nothing else? Pills? Sure. Shotgun shell. No room in inventory. What have I been doing this whole time? Yeah, whatever. You don't know. The dead rat is far less useful. Probably. Oh, I should pick that up and pick one of those up and like show it to the the musician, because I found a bunch of dead rats in his place, so presumably he has some kind of interest in them. For reasons I still don't totally understand, but I'm sure will be discovered if only I, uh, you know, get there. Alrighty. Alright, let's go explore that hole that I can go down that I didn't know I could go down. This is a super long video. I'm pretty sure I've been here for maybe 40 minutes. I don't know. Enter the large hole. What can go wrong? What? Where am I? My hideout? What? Really? Has this been here the whole time? Or did this only appear just now? I'm gonna look in the videos, because if this has been a thing that I just ignored this whole time, I will be very sad. It's still alarming that there's a connection between...
that city and my hideout so directly. But convenient! So, alright, well actually let's make use of it now. Because I'm going to go in the well, and that is a dangerous proposition. So, let's make sure that I don't regret going in the well. No, don't close that door. Through the wardrobe. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Can I upgrade the workshop? No, I need the welder thing. Ah, alright. Well, I can at least... No, you get somewhere else. That's all I need, right? Now I just need the welder thing. We're good. Pills. This. No, I have just the one. Carry it around. Ah. Bottle. I'm just gonna drop that. And then let's also drop stuff off here. Wait, no, the other one. I have fighting stuff. The fighting stuff box. I could also start putting stuff in here in the other one, the other wardrobe if I really wanna. I don't think I have room for additional Oh, for I can drop one in. I guess. Alright. I'm good. I hope that doesn't disappear or something. Has this been here the whole time? Damn it. I literally... How long is that hole, then? It must be an enormous hole. Alrighty. So before I go down here, since I crashed the last time I did this, I'm actually going to, you might notice a little glitch, because I'm going to go ahead and stop the video, and then start it again, um, and I'll stitch them together if everything goes fine, but hopefully this is all that I have to do. Alright, and we're back. Let's do that. Cool. Let's also do that. So I can return to the surface via nondescript means. Torch and flares. That's nice of them. Just a pack down here. Alrighty. Like a nook. Oh, what? Oh, I guess the intensity falls off too quickly. What's with the drawings on the floor? Give me a sec. I remember hearing chomper noises, so. What? Why can't I hear that? There you are. Hi. You look worse. Oh, wait, what? Oh. Right, right. I forgot that the axe does that to them. Ow, what? To, sh to kill you with my acid blood. I'm gotten really bad at the combat. Oh, hey, another doll. Or a small burned one. Maybe I should take that the weird lady? These things are creepy. And meat. Great. Troops? Yes, please. Man, this place is just... Mm, I don't like it. Too many ways in which things can go horribly wrong. Uh, no, this... Alright. More choppers? Hopefully not. Where does this go? Don't like this. What's this? Oh, corner. Alrighty then. Um, what is... What am I looking at here? Ooh, ooh. What is this? 
Um, okay. Oh. I don't know. This just freaks me out. I can tell what it is. I also really dislike the labyrinthine... labyrinthine? nature of all this stuff. So this is just blocked off, I guess. I feel like I could get lost, but I guess it's actually pretty linear in practice. Alright. We don't have to run away from something. What is... more trees? I hear noises that sound like mushrooms. Sorry, I'm quiet because I really need to make sure that I don't screw this up. Oh, that just looks gross. I feel like it's a face. Don't like this. It's been too quiet. There's only one chomper. Wait, what was that? Is that just a visual artifact? Nope, there's stuff down here. This is woody. Uh, oh no, I'm gonna run out of battery soon, but that's okay, because I have plenty of spares. Plenty of spares. Two, actually, which does limit how long I can tread around down here. I'm relaxing a little bit now. Just because it's been a while. Mm, kind of. Damn it, music, go away. Do that to me now. Alright. stuff over there. I'm tempted to run to it. What? There's a draft. I don't like the drawings on the ground at all. They really, uh... Make me uncomfortable. Just like weird big people. I feel like I want to go down there, but I want to make sure I feel like something bad will happen, so I want to make sure I explore first, in case it cuts off too many things. I hope I don't get lost. Well, I guess we have the torch as a last resort kind of thing. is this. This is the place that needs a key everywhere. Alright. Cool. I don't know how we climbed up through that, frankly. Oh, I was wasting battery that whole time. That's unfortunate. I hear a lot of mushroom noises, though. Barricaded this door. Probably a wise move, seeing as it just goes down into a giant pit. Ah, chicken lady key. Great. That's in a very different place. It used to be that that was, uh, it was like the last thing you got in the game. It was almost like a bonus. You would get it after meeting the doctor and surviving the dream. I don't know if you had to survive it, actually. But you'd get it then, and then you'd be able to go and uh, do stuff. 
Um, oh, I can remove the blockade. Great. The oven. Anything under the table? No. Stool. Cool. That's my way out, I guess. Okay, this used to be this, the item that you got at the very beginning. Smakulski. 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 Um, I don't know. Hard to read the rest. Needs key. Do I have a key? I don't have a key. Alright, so I have to exit to the top. I want to make sure I grab those mushrooms because I hear them. They taunt me. There they are. I hear more over here. There we go. Maybe? I can't really tell where they are. Ah. What are we doing overall in terms of um, lifetime? I hear more. There they are. That's a lot of essence. That's a good reward. Decent reward. What I still don't quite understand is all of the drawings and stuff down here. I don't really... Isn't there a path that I didn't take? Maybe? I don't know. I'm not going to spend too much time down here. Maybe there's some cool stuff. Maybe there isn't. I don't particularly care right now. Alright, we got our key. This is also probably why they time stop this place, just because it's huge and you're doing quests in the middle of it. It would suck if you had to be like, well, I can't do that now. I gotta run off and and do the, the thing. I think maybe a more judicious use of the time stop would be cool, but I don't know. I guess it does say something about the whole night day mechanic in general, uh, that it just, it's a little bit restrictive than when you try to do these kinds of segments. Because, you know, you always have to be worrying about the time, but sometimes you don't want the player to worry quite so much about the time. Ah, I found an old dog tag. You! Can I? No, I don't actually have that as an item, do I? Well, before I go to the chicken lady, I'm gonna go to the holes. Well, I guess you're here. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do what I gotta do. Hey, you. Was this still hungry? I would give you some soup, but how would you eat it? Some people have suggested that that means, that suggests that maybe we don't have a mouth, but I think she's just suggesting as to, like, we don't have utensils. Okay, you can't show that to him. Alright. Used to be that you showed her the dog tag, and she would, um... Oh god, please don't hang. Okay, cool. She would, uh... whine about her brother. But this time, it's, uh, it's just... Just a chick, I guess. I don't know what I'm gonna do with the weird dolls. Gotta do something with them, I'm sure. I really want that block peg, but... Yeah, it's not happening. Go and trade stuff. There he is, he's still here. Yeah. Ah. It's a little bit unnerving that there is just a large hole that goes directly to, you know, right next to your hideout. It's just a little alarming. Cook, right, I don't care about that right now. That is a lot of stuff. Man, that's not too far off. Before I go back into a place that has time, 
Uh, let me gather my thoughts on what I need to do with these. I think I need to move the torch, drop the bottle again. Um, the flares and stuff I gotta put away in the, the like items pool. Right? Stack of useless things. Can't put it there, but I can put it here. Flare. Don't need those. I hope I got that turned off. Seems like I do. It's not consuming stuff. Uh, uh, yeah, I guess this. Why not? No, wait, picked the wrong item. Oop. Almost on cue. Um, let me deal with that real quick. Just because I don't know that there will be too much more video, but it would suck if stuff cut off just because I was too obstinate to charge my headset. <laughs> Alright. Oh wait, does, does time advance while you're... no, okay, so that wasn't a waste of effort. Still laggy, which is unnerving. Alright, I'm gonna go back through here, just because it's super convenient. <sighs> Mr. Yon's house. So yeah, that was Mr. Yon's house, I suppose. It's all locked up. Oh hey, it's like the time did advance here, it's just stopped. I think it would be cooler if it was always a particular time. Right, right. Uh, it's like this perpetual moment. I'll check the ladies to the other side. Crap, the frame rate. Why is it chugging? This game is not that intensive. I think my computer is dying. It's on its last legs. Actually, should I go be. Should I be grabbing the musician? Can I do this myself? Sure. I'll take that. some kind of boss now. Sheet and a few pairs of worn trousers. That's okay. I don't know what else I expected, honestly. Oh yes, military flashlight. Oh, a wedding ring. Does it bring it up? No. Pile of crumpled pillows and pillowcases. Looks like someone has slept here. Fabric. Very good quality fabric. Yeah, so now you can... Um, well now her cover, her request to be covered makes sense too. Because she's apparently beautiful, but... Not so much anymore. Should I grab this? Potato definitely should grab. Steering wheel less certain. I'm gonna go ahead and grab the eggs then while I'm here. Man, the frame rate. Why? What's going on here? It's fine sometimes. This is the first time I use OBS with FLV. I wonder if that has some implications. I've been using MP4 before, but when it crashed and I started beating around about what I could do about the zero byte file that I was... that I had, I was like, oh, well, you know, MP4 needs to switch stuff at the end of the file, so you should switch to FLV so you can't have a corrupted file. And I was like, that sounds great. Except it wouldn't have helped me, or it didn't. Um, I did a trial run where I turned off my computer, like a forcible shutdown while it was recording my monitor. And that video was also zero bytes, so something about it didn't flush to the file system in any way it makes it suck. All right. Um, is there anything else for me to do here? 
Let's turn salt to our journal, which is now actually useful. Key to the underground. All right, here we go. Wolf's proposition. Key to a. Lo oh, he asked me to bring it. He'll be able to find the key. He will tell me where I'll be able to find the key. Oh, okay. She lives in a village, which can be found in the southeast. I wanted to see it for myself. I'd forgotten about his proposition, actually. Chicken's lady's brother. I to see the doctor. I recognize the fucker. Of course you do. I met a boy in the village. He told me that in the locked room said chicken lady is a pretty lady. He really, he really wants to see it. The old lady does not let him. He asked me to find the key to this room. The boy will return to his hideout in a silo, which could be found in the southeastern part of the silent forest. The chicken lady's key. The boy told me that there is a spare key to the pretty lady's room. I could probably find it near the well in the village. It sounds ridiculous, but it's the only lead I have. Doctor's photo. The boy with the violin recognized the local daughter on the photo given to me by the chicken lady. He says he's a good man. He's helping the villagers. He helped me too, and then stole my fucking key. He's so upset about it. Yeah, I'm sure we'll of that at some point. Oh my god, the frame rate! Why? Um... Alright, what to do? I guess we could try to talk to him really quickly. We have enough time to jog straight south. And then north again. What, night starts at 8? We're surprisingly close to the silo, if I remember. It was alarming. What happened here? Not that I really care. No, you you keep your distance. I don't really want to deal with the likes of you right now. No, you mustn't. We're fine. Don't worry about it. I don't know why he did that to the back, though. It's a little creepy. Yeah. I love this place. Where are you? There you are. Boy stops playing and lowers his head, avoiding my sight. See? He's the same as always. Show item. I could give him the key. Oh, so I still have the key. Plastic chick. It's so pretty. Can I hold? The boy clumsily tries to handle the small object with his overgrown hands. My mom likes things like these. Where did you buy it? If I were grown up, I could buy her something as beautiful as this. And maybe she wouldn't be angry with me anymore. Uh, so I can presumably I can give him the key, or I can give it to Wolf. I won't make that decision right now. I usually side with the boy, just because Wolf is a bit of a shady character. Um, yeah. I mean, he's hideous, but I do know sort of what's been going on around here. It's not his fault he's hideous. It's not make him evil to be hideous. Whereas Wolf is almost certainly evil. Not evil. Certainly not exactly a person deserving of uh, too much sympathy, I suppose is the way you could put it. Alright, we'll make it just in time, especially if I don't have to engage in any combat. Please let me not engage in any combat. Here we are. I remember this place. Yep. We're good. Night starts at 8. We've got half an hour. Which reminds me, I haven't been checking the gasoline levels on stuff. How is it doing? You got a night in you? We got more than a night in you. We're, we're fine. Alright. Here we go. Night 13. Hopefully it will go better than night 12 apparently went. Although with the frame rate, I'm not sure I can promise anything. Can you... What do I do with that? Can I do anything with it? I guess I could put it in her inventory. That seems like a good idea. Um... Yes. As far as inventory management, I do not need that much rag. Thank you. Don't need the flashlight now either, because I have the military one. Let's go and see what we can stash over here instead. 
I hope there isn't another Banshee. I've just been so regularly doing completely poorly with them. Anyway, we'll take another one. Don't really need to be carrying on pills and bread and potatoes. And eggs. Uh, and torch. I don't know. There's a lot of... What? Wait. Oh, is that open? No. He's just angry. Stay away from me. Ugh. Now, please don't tear it down. I don't want to rebuild after you. Uh. I like how I can sell this, though. That's the spirit. Did he break it? No, he did. I'm probably gonna want to keep that open in the event of a banshee, because running outside is... Th this place is too closed. And I don't know how to really... In the past, they used to just kind of wander aimlessly and just had to kind of keep your distance, and it was fine. But my experience so far seems to be that they actually hunt you down. Which doesn't really work. I can examine the oven. Do these say anything that hasn't been read already? Okay. Okay, so, so I thought maybe I'd found a way to cook during the night anyway, but eh. At least they're walking on the outside. Or oh, they're stuck. Um. Pulse Trigeist? Yes. Uh. As long as they don't overlap too much, everything's fine. I'm just positioning this because whenever there's a banshee they always come in through the only door available so I can at least like consider pulling this up and going through first uh-oh, shadows. Which one will it be? Hey, buddy. Hopefully not something outside. Because that would be super lame. Oh, cool, I picked the right one. What? Why? Why? I really hope the shadows murder them. I really don't have anything that I could put in here. Piotrek used to take the weird stones. I wonder if I can just generally sell them. Oh, right, no, that's just them. The noises they make. Ah, uh, yes. Uh. More shadows? What does this mean? Yes. The answer is yes, more shadows. Is this a bottle? Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and stuff you in here somewhere. Eesh. Kinda like that they hit the walls and stuff now though. Gives them that not quite ethereal feeling. Ah! Whoa! What? They actually damage it. Maybe. Hard to tell sometimes. I'm gonna go before I talk to you. I'm gonna go turn off the generator. Honestly, you can see. So that's like two and a half per night. It's not too bad. There are worse fates. Uh pull you out to I don't even know. I think I had you. 
like this. Because I want you to light that this place a little bit, but it's not crucial that you do it. Because the best place for this, in case I do need to drag it, is to just make it as simple as possible to drag without being in the way. So there we go. This light is exactly where it needs to be, actually. This is broken, so let's go patch that up. It happened to have just the right amount of planks and stuff. Is that hole still there? It is! Did I really just miss it this whole time? Hey, mm. three. You are not interested in any of my weird shit. Alright. I can trade away the wedding ring. That's great. I can also trade away the flashlight feel it. So it's currently worth... I, yeah, it's worth more if I do do it. So, 200... Can I get up... I, I can get up to 200 if I wanna. I kinda wanna. Give me a sec. I wish there was a... like you could long click these to reload them because having to do turn them on with a little bit of battery then right click it's a little tedious um yes and I want to also pick up shuffle edge they don't want the shuffle edge either do they nobody wants the shuffle edge I feel like I'm say, trying to save these up for something but I don't know what it is I'm going to go ahead and combine everything these stack? Oh, they do! Great! I didn't know that. I thought I must have thought they didn't. Uh, I guess I do want to try that at some point. Why do I have so many freaking matches? That is a lot of matches. Take that back. Molotovs. 2.87. That's interesting that it knows that. Molotovs are nice to have. I am considering making one. For now, though. Uh, no. Not that many. Just the spare. Enough for an emergency. Um, so I can sell that for a hundred. Keep carrying that around. Nobody wants that for whatever reason. Do I have anything else I could get rid of? Is that a second flashlight? That is a second flashlight. Go ahead and give that to the three as well. And all the rest is still kind of useful, so... Alrighty. You can have... These two flashlights that I have for some reason I don't really remember. Welder, yes! Also, I'll take my usual quota. Great. I don't know what's up with the frame rate this time. Go for it. Go. Take it. Ooh, we're close to. Makes it really tempting to just make it happen. Uh, yes. Upgrade the workshop. I can make guns now. Which gun should I make? Pistol? Single shot shotgun. I've never had really good success with that one. I've always been more of the double barrel guy. It's always worked better for me. It requires lots of, of uh, wood, turns out. Unsurprisingly. Wait, how much wood did the previous one take? I think there's more missing than I had in the little like, set aside slot. I need 18 nails. Let's go ahead and set that aside because nails exist in near super abundance in this world. Actually, so do matches. As well as wood. And the usual special items, which I do not really have. So that goes to the tree. The tree, huh? Tree and three. I wonder if that's intentional. Really? I don't want it. Yeah, yeah. Kinda almost want to get that. So I can get that additional lockpick. Um, value 7. Such a random number. Just the one. 
Oh wait, why aren't these? Why don't I have these separately? When did that happen? Why haven't I noticed this? Alright, I don't need that many, so I'm gonna go ahead and keep these though. I, re I remember regretting not having some around. <sighs> what would they take? The rats, maybe? No, that wouldn't be enough. Stick, maybe? It really angers me that nobody wants... Not even Wolf wants the weapon part. It seems odd, because he bills himself as such a... I take weapons. I don't know. Let's try the rope. I know it's not the best option, but it's what I got. And I want... I don't want to have the... I want that lockpick now, so that I can do it next time. Um, where is it? Oh, they don't want the rope. Great. Fine. Does that set you... Does that tied you up? They nod. Yes. Great. You can add the stupid rags. I don't need them anyway. I have enough spare shit. Why do I always carry around the rags anyway? I don't know, it's just a weird habit that I acquired from earlier days that I just keep keep using. Put these here. I don't really know what chains are for long long term, so yeah. Alright, I'm happy with that layout and this weird reservation scheme. I don't really know what I want from that. I do know that I want a lockpick out of this, though. Yes! Alrighty. I think that's enough prepping. I like that this hole is still there. I really hope that I didn't somehow miss it the whole time. Um, but yeah, it's day 14 now. Miraculously, I didn't lose all the footage in that I thought I did, so next time we'll get started with day 14, and uh, I guess I'll decide on who I want to toss the, the key to, and we'll probably uh, do a little bit, I'm sure we'll go back to the village at some point. As always, thank you for watching, and I'll catch you next time.